ओके सो हाई गाइज वेलकम बैक टू अनदर वीडियो सो इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू ऑल अबाउट द न्यू ए एम डी रेडियो ऑन सॉफ्टवेयर सो इन दिस सॉफ्टवेयर एम डी जस्ट रिलीज अ न्यू फीचर कॉल्ड एज ए एम डी फ्लूड मोशन फ्रेम्स सो यूजिंग दिस टेक्नोलॉजी वॉट हैपन इज दैट यू कैन डबल और ट्रिपल योर फ्रेम रेट्स ऑन योर फेवरेट गेम्स एंड according to my testing uh, it is working on almost all the games so a lot of guys have been asking me like how you can enable that for a specific game or all the games so what you guys need to do is so uh, you have to go on the second tab of your radeon software so in this gaming tab uh, you have to select the particular game for which you want to enable AMD fluid motion frames that is the frame generation technology to enable that first that game should show up here okay so if in case let's take an example if that game doesn't show up here so what you guys need to do is uh, you have to click on these three dots you have to click on scan for games if that still doesn't work you need to click on this and add a game so you have to find that exe file of that particular game that you want to add here on the software so after adding the games that you want to enable amd fluid motion frame generation technology so for example i'll give you example of loader so i'll click on it so once you click on it uh, this thing get open so in this you have to uh, click hyper rx here okay once you click on hyper rx it will automatically enable or disable some of the things okay according to the software so what in this option you need to enable amd fluid motion frames manual or something like a similar name might be there for you according to the system specification so you have to enable this okay once you enable this it will not directly uh, show the generated frames in the client fps stats okay so to check the exact fps that you are getting after enabling this you have to enable this overlay okay so i have already set that up okay but you guys can i think figure it out yourself uh, in this uh, fields you have to enable for fps or like whatever you guys want to select as the as the matrices you guys can select that okay so after that i have enabled it for dota 2 now as i okay so i will be launching the game now and you guys will be able to see Let's go and watch again. Okay, it seems like it's not enabled properly. So I will be relaunching the game now. Because if it worked perfectly then this NA should have changed. But as in this case, it didn't change. So I will be closing the game once and I will relaunch it.
as you guys can see the frame gen lag is showing the yeah see this this caption should come amd fluid motion frames as enabled okay so what it took was for me to do is like i went to the video section i clicked on the advanced settings and just applied it once more so my uh, resolution got refreshed and it started working as you guys can see the fps are boosted and as you can see the frame gen lag is not na now so now i'll show you for example i will be watching a live replay and you guys will be able to see the fps Middle tower is I'm under getting attack. around 186, 189, almost 200 Radiant FPS has been on Dota 2, and that is on 4K maximum settings. This is 4K resolution, and as you can see, every setting is enabled. I am using SSR, the AMD technology, the other AMD technology that I'm using, SSR, and everything is maxed out. You guys can see the difference in FPS. Also, you guys can check another video of mine in which I have shown the FPS without this technology enabled. In that video, I was getting 90 FPS or it even bent down uh, around 60 FPS in intense situations. But as you guys can see, the AMD frame generation technology is giving me almost Doubled that frame. Middle tower is under I'm getting attack. around 250 200 FPS. Dyer's structures are fortified. The next radius is under attack. So, Radiance top I would like to also inform you guys that to make this work, for this all to work, three things you need to understand. Okay, so first thing is that this software should be updated to its latest version. So as you, as you guys can see, I will click on check for updates and it is up to date. So this should be all, all this it should be on the latest version, the AMD software. Okay. After that, you need to go on this tab and you have to check if AMD smart access memory is enabled or not. So this is another AMD technology, AMD smart access memory, SAM for short. So this should be enabled and when I uh like uh, showed you the dota 2 settings i had ssr enabled as well so total of three different technologies i have enabled and that resulted in 200 fps so you guys can also benefit from the same like i'm doing so thanks for watching we'll meet in another video thank you for watching bye bye